Hi everyone, it's Tiffany and I am here with all three of the brand new build a -Bot bugs. We have Busy Bee, Ladybug, and Scatter Ant. And they look so cool. I do want to thank the company for sending these to me. These, I love build a -Bot to begin with. I loved the first range of characters that they made. They had a bunny, a dino, and a fox. And now we have bugs, it's so cool. So BuildBot is a line of colorful and cute robots built using easy click and create systems. With three designs to choose from, right here, <laughs> kids can create their very own working bug, learn about gears, electric power, and more. Watch how the motor works to make the bug's legs crawl and wings flap. Oh, that sounds so cool. You can also attach additional bugs to create a caterpillar. <gasps> what? And let's see, build a bot bug provides children with a toy that stimulates STEM STEM learning, encourages real world application, real world application, and problem solving skills. Each bug comes with 25 plus pieces to construct a functional and transparent robot to teach how different components function to create a robot. That's so awesome. These will be on shelves now. They should be on shelves now. I've seen them at Walmart. And they are, let's see, anything else? Yes, they are $14.99 each. They are available at Walmart, spring 2018. So they're showing up now. Um, if you don't see them, they should be hitting shelves very, very soon. We are going to be taking a look at each one of these today. So let's go ahead and turn it around. I do love the packaging, how there's like a little bite taken out of it. Oh, whoopsies. We're just going to turn these guys around. And you can kind of see like the parts that you get and everything. It says Build, Learn, Connect. And then it shows the other bugs you can get, which we already have here. It just seems so, like so much fun. And I cannot wait to open these up. Each pack contains 23 bug pieces, two bug wings, sticker sheet, three cell batteries, learning guide and a build certificate. So let's go ahead and get these out so we can start building them. I just wanted to show you real quickly, this is how each of the packs are laid out. So they are nicely laid out. You can tell which part is which very easily. And then you have a bunch of just tiny ones right there. I love it. It does seem more simple to put together than the first one. I'm thinking, unless the pieces are just way tinier. So I believe that, I don't know. Um, we do have a little booklet that also comes in each pack. I'm trying to get it open currently. Let's see, hold on one second. All right, we have it open. So we have the stickers. Um, I think these are, are these the wings? We have the wings, the stickers, we have the eyeballs, and then I guess just like little things you could put on them. And oh, look out for more characters. These are the ones you can collect. I like how it checks off the one that you got. Okay, and this is the guide. So let's open this up. All right, where does it start? There's one right here. So this is where the guide starts. It goes from one to, oh, here's your certificate as well. You can cut that out. You put your build date, bug name, place of build, and build by, which is so cute. And then if we turn this around, this goes to, I guess, just nine, nine steps to complete your bug, which is so exciting. And then, oh, no, 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 It goes to 10 steps to complete your bug, and then this shows you how to make the caterpillar. That's so neat. So you just kind of omit the heads, I would assume, and then att attach them there via the bottom. That's really nice how they give you instructions to make the caterpillar. And they even have fun facts. It says, did you know why bees... Did you know why bees need a lot of energy? Bees fly up to 24 kilometers and beat their wings 230 times per second or 12,000 beats per minute. Wow, these are awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and start building this first one here. I'm going, oh sorry guys, I <laughs> like punched the camera. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to kind of speed build this just because we have three of them. It will take a long time if I, uh, go through it uh, verbally but just just roughly I mean it's pretty easy if you look at the instructions you know it's steps one two three four five and it even tells you I think I showed you but I'm going to show you again right here it labels the parts so if it says you need part a where I don't know where does it say <laughs> I don't know let's say you need part a you'll know the body is part a so that's always awesome. I love how they make it super clear 
to create these and I, I love that about these. So I'm going to go ahead and start speed building this and I will be back when it's ready to test out. Okay, you guys, here is the be all done. And can I just say, oh my gosh, these are shoes. <laughs> like, I was freaking out when I first saw them. I thought they were just like average, like little trinket pieces, not trinket, like little pieces for the whole motor and everything. But these are shoes. There are shoes. I'm looking to see. They all have shoes. I'm freaking out. So. Here we go. That's, this was, I think this was much easier to assemble. The most difficult part was these, installing these legs and stuff. But as I've showed you in the instructions, they just are so clear about it. They give you an up close picture of how they're supposed to be aligned and everything. And I just, I love it. It's so nice. So what we're going to do now is we're going to kind of try them out and see what it does. So let's see. I'm not sure where is your little on off switch. Here it is. Right here is his on and off switch. So just go, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at him go. These are the best. Oh, I love these. I love these little bugs. They are the best. Oh my gosh. Look at his little wings go. Look at his little wings. He's running. He's just like, see you guys. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. All right, as much as I loved the dino and fox and rabbit from the last one, I think these are my favorite now. You guys, if you haven't tried Build-A-Bot, honestly, try these. Like, I, I, I love these things. So next, we're going to go and speed build our ant, which should be, it's just going to be the same process. Just, you know, a few different parts just different colors basically so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then we'll take a closer look at him running around like crazy with his little bee friend oh my gosh I'm so freaking out it's so cute Okay, you guys, I ended up speed building both of these guys because why not? <laughs> and of course, like I mentioned before, you get stickers, you can put them, decorate their wings and stuff so you can make the ladybug spotted. You can do some lightning bolts on the ant. You can put some of these on the bee, the stripes. I think that's such a nice touch. I can't get over these shoes. Can I just say that? Oh my gosh. All right, let's go ahead in. Oh my gosh, I love these guys. 
Now, one thing I messed up on so bad were the eyes on this guy. <laughs> He definitely has wonky eyes, my bad, completely. I tried taking the stickers off again, but they're on there. I'm gonna try to get them off and then put on some new eyes. Like, they're just bad. I just put them on so wrong, but he looks crazy. He just looks like he's crazy and ready to go. And then, here's, I like how all their wings are different shapes, so I know it's really hard to tell since they're uh, kind of translucent. And then we have this lovely ladybug. I think she's so beautiful. I love her. Let's Watch her move. Oh my gosh, you guys. I love these. You can have like little races with these guys. And then right here, that's where you would attach the bodies to one another. So you just pop off the heads and attach them that way. Okay guys, quickly I'm going to show you how to assemble the caterpillar. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be so funny. So I left the little head on this guy, took these guys' heads off, and then what you do is it's like this, and then you press that and it pops out. So you'll just connect them this way. They snap right in. I guess you would ha you could turn all of them on. I wonder if turning just one on would do anything. Okay, no, they all need to be on. So you just turn them all on. Oh my goodness. Whoa! <laughs> I love it, you guys. This is absolutely cool. And then, of course, you can mix and match. So, if you wanted the bee to have the ladybug's body, you could. Oh my goodness. Come back. Come back. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. I gotta turn these guys off before they go too, too far. Let me know which one of these bugs is your favorite in the comment section down below. I'm going to choose the bee as my favorite. They're all so hilarious. I love when they move. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because I post new videos every single day. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!